Mili Muharrab Uçak, or Khan, is a Turkish acronym that stands for National Fighter Aircraft, which made its first flight today. Turkish Aerospace Industries, TAI, is developing this fifth-generation stealth air superiority fighter for the Turkish Air Force. Turkey intends to officially replace its F-16 fleet with the CAN by 2030-2035. To lower radar cross-section, the design includes stealth elements like as internal weapon bays, S-shaped air intakes, and angled surfaces. Turkey uses General Electric F-110 GE-129 for powering the prototype. In future, it is expected to be powered by TR Motors TF-6000 turbofan engine, which is being developed with international partners. The plan is to eventually use a Turkish-made engine. CAN will include domestically built avionics such as ESA radar, electro-optical targeting, and a Turkish integrated modular avionics system. The CAN fighter was developed between 2017 and 2018, prior to Turkey's F-35 withdrawal. However, following losing the F-35, CAN has taken on a higher priority, with a faster schedule aiming at replacing F-16s by the 2030s. Turkey was initially a partner in the F-35 program, intending to purchase 100 F-35A fighters for the Turkish Air Force. However, due to Turkey's purchase of the Russian S-400 air defense system, the United States suspended Turkey from the F-35 program in 2019 and halted delivery of the fighters. This left Turkey without a planned next-generation fighter to replace its aging F-16s. It highlighted the significance of constructing an indigenous CAN jet. Turkish President Recep Tayyip Erdogan has stated that the CAN project demonstrates that Turkey no longer requires the F-35 and can become self-sufficient in defense. Analysts regard the CAN as part of Turkey's larger goals of developing more domestic defense capabilities, particularly in aerospace, after losing access to modern Western systems, such as the F-35. The maiden flight is a great accomplishment, but it is only one stage in a lengthy development process. Before Khan can be operational, it will need to undergo additional testing and changes. The project has received significant criticism for its delays and costs, but the Turkish government remains dedicated to producing its own fifth-generation fighter plane. Now, Turkey needs an engine that is made in Turkey to export it to other countries. Will Turkey be able to make its own engines? Let us know in the comments. We discuss such interesting subjects every day. Please subscribe to the channel and share and like the videos.